But Dude, what? Yo, see those cokes over there? Yeah, I see them. I want you to jack them. Dude, you want me to walk up and just grab those cokes? Yeah, I want you to jack jack those cokes. Dude. <laughs> no shit, one opened on its own for some reason. Dude, no, I think it's hot. They're hot. They're, it's, it's so hot out here. Yeah, the it's like cokes, 115 degrees or something. They're boiling and bubbling in their cans. They're just blowing. Oh, there goes another. Holy man. You gotta jack them before they all explode. Dude, if I jack those cokes and I put them in a car, they're gonna blow over my car. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, yeah, you're right. Oh, we Dude, can't just sit down, here and watch We're down it. to three out of that six-pack. Oh, my goodness. I better go jump. Okay, two. We got two. T- okay. Luckily, there's two of us, so this should be easy. Yeah, yeah I'll walk over there and okay. jack them. Yeah, yeah, okay. okay. Oh, right. oh, you better hurry. There's one left. Okay, here. Yeah, I'm going to grab it. I got okay, it. Okay, go, go, go. I got it. I got it. I got it. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, 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 I saw. Now I got to take a shower. Ah, oh, yeah. Let's go home, take a shower, Dang and listen it. to that new episode of... Uh, <laughs> Welcome to Robot Sidekick, the comedy podcast starring yours truly, Brian Rodzinski, and with him always is J.C. Carlson. How's it going? Hey, Brian. Hey. So, <laughs> we have two guests with us, return guests, good friends of the show, and good friends in just normal everyday life things. Aww. Let's start with the one who makes the best random bottle opening <laughs> sounds for no apparent reason. <laughs> Kayla Steiner. Oh, and she snorts when she does. <laughs> After I got my tonsils and adenoids crisped out of my Stop. Throat. Okay, bye. And Oh, I have mine still. Tonsils? Yep. We'll get into that. And if you those. if you haven't recognized his man voice yet and <laughs> his silly gigs. Um Stand-up comedian, improv comedian, and... Realtor extraordinaire. <laughs> we'll get into the paid advertisement here soon, buddy. Ryan Johnson back with us. Hey, Ryan. Hey, guys. Hey. I'm so happy to be here. And Kayla, hello also. Hi. Good to see you both. Both very Thanks. pretty. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thank you. I get that a lot. Yeah, I tell you guys that a lot, so... Older women love me. Oh, yeah? Yep. <laughs> totally. They do. That's good. I, uh, That's so weird. What that brought that upon that? you? Yeah, because they do love me too. Oh yeah. Do they, yeah. Do you have? I'm okay. You know those scenes in movies where an old woman like grabs a hold of a dude and kisses him full on the mouth? What movie? No. Are you ta- <laughs> what? Hold on, what uh, movie? Okay. 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 It's very uh, general. No. No. Okay. Scene. So an old you, woman. Okay. I'm thinking of Soy Mary Knox murder. Have you seen that movie? Well, I, oh. No. Wait, I think I have. Is that Soy Berry Knox murder? So I married <laughs> an, an axe, axe murder. murder. I thought he said soy too. I, I heard Soy Berry Knox murder, and I was like, oh, so, man. so you haven't seen Soy it's Berry a, it's Knox a vegetarian murder? Movie. Have not seen Soy Dude, Berry. Dude, me and Brian, we've seen Soy Berry Knox murder. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, okay. It's won a lot of Sundance Film Awards. Oh, yeah. for its for its true yeah, veganism. they were. Um, yep, yeah, best in show. Okay. Lesbian yeah. veganism. Yeah. It was. Uh, they, they shot it on. Film that didn't use animal product. Well, that's uh, good. Dude, it was dope. It was oh. amazing. No gluten, no uh, gelatin, because that's also you can't eat that if you're vegan. I don't and think f- gluten is an animal product, though. Yeast can be considered if- um, non-vegan, actually. Do do <laughs> vegans worry <laughs> so. that inside of them there's like three pounds of living material? You know, speak it. Like you know, how, <laughs> in everybody again. Bacteria. Very general. We have three pounds of bacteria living in us right now. Oh, like, I, three yeah. pounds? Three pounds. That's what they say. Yeah. Yeah. they? Science. People. Oh, okay. So if I take and like I feel like I people want to that on right now. NPR. People, that's so if you take like an antibiotic, would it like shed some pounds yeah, on Yeah, yeah, no. You take antibiotics and it kills all the mm-hmm. good stuff. What and that's why you need for? to take probiotics. You, it actually takes about seven years for your body to get back to normal. Yeah, and we always hear the rumors. Did mm. you know you can, and you can cross pollinate your bacteria? Like if you, if you had really bad gas and your wife gas wasn't as bad, if you put your finger <laughs> still, in still kind her, of bad <clears throat> in her fanny and then plant and then put your finger in your fanny. You would get her bacteria, and it would help you. That's the thing, too. You sure it's not AIDS? <laughs> yes, I'm sure that's not AIDS. So if, if AIDS, I... AIDS is similar. So let's just, let's just, if, okay. I well, in fact, AIDS it. actually I helps gas. So our, our residential medical student says it doesn't exist. <laughs> so. No, I said I can't. I searched bacteria gut weight. No, you gotta search. You gotta search bacteria <laughs> butthole search. transference. That's oh, that is a thing. Yeah, yeah. I'm, dude. I'm not. I don't make anything up. Yeah, I wish yeah, I could. I'll just trust you, I guess. So I tell me I more could. about uh, the soybean Knox murder. <laughs> okay, 
So it's a horror movie. <laughs> recently, um, my mom brought her friend to uh-huh. Improv Mania. Great place, where, by the way. Oh, I love oh, it. that place. It's downtown, so good. Downtown Chandler. Downtown Chandler. So Chandler. Good. Have yeah, so much fun there. Arizona oh. Avenue and Fry. Laughs for days. Oh my gosh, that place. So she brought her friend, and her friend saw me. hadn't I don't know, like I hadn't met her for a while or whatever. And she's like, "You are so handsome." You are it's hand- so weird that she and she was like that. touching my chest, like rubbing my oh, chest, wow. what? and saying how handsome I was. Has she been how, drinking? How old is this woman? Um, I'm going to say six, late fifties. Okay. In her six, yeah. Well, my mom just turned wow. sixty, so she's late fifties, sixties. Oh wow, yeah. And th- oh wait, no, they have the same birthday, which is the new forty. Yeah. So then, later on, like the next day, my mom is like, "Hey, Margot thought you were so pr- handsome." <laughs> I'm like, yeah, thanks, mom. Like, Margo's the perfect name for your mom's friend, by the way. Which, yeah, so I don't know. Anyway, it's, women, yeah. old women think I'm a drag. All right, what's yours? What's my old woman story? <laughs> yeah. Um. Well, I was walking down the street just because I like to go on walks, and the sun just like beautifully came through the horizon, and I saw. No, I don't have an old person. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wait, I, I missed the point where was this sunrise or Hang sunset? On. It was hard to tell. I missed the point where old women kiss me. That's oh, the yeah. point. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We were right, talking right. about it. Is that old? It like, seemed like you fizzled the story out, though. I know. I got into all that other crap. I'm sorry. Touches but I've had chest and... more than one old woman in their like late 50s to 70s kiss me full on the mouth. Like my aunt, my wife's aunt's. <laughs> Oh. Is that sexual hmm. harassment? Because I always feel like there's it's a double family. standard with it's like family. with old ladies, <laughs> no, <laughs> no. <laughs> older women to men, like to guys. Other than like, what if an old man, like a sixty-year-old guy, yeah. did Ugh. that to like some a girl your age? Like people would look at that and be like, "That's Was not it okay." Their nephew or niece? By Were you marriage? related? Were you related to the female? No, no, no. like the people. No, no. Usually, usually it was the, your aunt. The, it's my no. wife's aunt. Oh. So my no. wife's aunt's. I've had so no, so, not related. I've had more women than I can count kiss me. Old women kiss me <laughs> full on the mouth, like I, weird, maybe dating. I and, feel like and that's my okay, wife though. thinks it's hilarious. <laughs> She's just sitting there like ah ah no. ah. And old, I hit always, and old women hit like on Facebook. It happens a lot. I don't know. Interesting. Again, yeah. though. If I've the got this roles face. were reversed. I don't know enough it'd be, old. It'd be creepy. Women, it would be creepy. Right? I still think this is creepy. So. No, it's. I think it's creepy. I think it's totally creepy. It's I feel weird. F- flattered. I mean, it, there's really? got to be so flattered. I would I mean, be I would, super weirded out. I would, I would feel a little violated. I yeah. feel like yeah. if Amy ever dies, I've got so much old poon. <laughs> That's the like, spirit. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you know, all of her aunts. <laughs> but but once you get older. <laughs> Keep yep. it in the family. I think you should be appreciative if you get any poon. <laughs> oh my God. I was, that's so funny. Yeah, Amy dies, and I just start working through her aunts. <laughs> oh, it's what she would have wanted. Oh, <laughs> she, she loved it when no I question. kissed her aunts. Oh loved God. it. She thought this was hilarious. <laughs> I'm just going to sh- love sh- this. Doing this for Amy. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. It oh. seems like guys feel like... They're always thinking, like, when, especially when they're in relationships, that they can just always get vagina. Like, they think it's, like, so easy, and it's, like, on this, like, pedestal in <laughs> vice, their mind. Vice versa. <laughs> when you're not in a relationship, you feel like no girl ever <laughs> wants you. <laughs> yeah. But as soon as you're in a relationship, all of a sudden, it, it, it Every gets girl that feeling wants where the, the girls are just interested in you. Yeah. And you're like, wait, what the what fuck? The, where were you, like... Two years ago. <laughs> yeah, like, Where were you the past eight years of my life? <laughs> do you think that's like a perception thing on your end? Or do you think yeah. you really think girls are like... I think it's I a little bit of both. Speaking from a man's perspective... Yeah, no, I'm, I'm pretty serious. I'm curious. <laughs> so, and I'm just speaking <laughs> for I'm all curious. men here. So okay. I can't... I can't... I don't know the answer. I'm just speaking for all men. <laughs> yes. Excuse <laughs> yes. me. Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard it. Thanks. <laughs> I did the thing I hate that people do on podcasts. <laughs> no, but like, I think there's there times, is. There's a... times where there's times when you're in a relationship, at either married or in a relationship, that you think like, man, now that I'm taken, it seems like women are more interested. But there's also been times where like, now that I'm taken, it seems like women are just like, ugh. Or do you think you just like exude confidence because you 
you already feel comfortable in like your relationship dynamic. So I think, I think it's no. I was. I think it's. I don't know if it's a, like confidence, it's a confidence thing, but you're just comfortable to act normal around them. Oh, yeah, because you're not caring. Like you don't care about being like yeah, presentable. Yeah. You're not yep. trying to get them yeah. in bed. Yeah, because like yeah, yeah exactly. Like, so they're attracted to like your true self. Exactly. Because I now that I, I mean I'm married, I'm taken and everything, and I just like to joke around with yeah. girls and stuff, like their friends and stuff, and they probably. Would see that as just like, look at this guy. <laughs> you know, look just, at this fella. Look he this looks fella. like a nice fella. Hey, he's, he's so young. He looks I like bet. a young man I could kiss on the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I've been looking for a young man to kiss full on the mouth. Uh, I don't know. Big old sloppy so, kiss. So, do you I, think as you get older, the women that are attracted to you will still be the same age? Like, you'll be like, okay, they'll, they'll, they'll be like them? 80 and you'll be. Okay. Here's. <laughs> Getting... This is how I like played in my head. Sloppy mm-hmm. kisses. I am at, like this is like my narcissism totally like on display. Oh yeah. I believe that old women are in like old women are just more comfortable with their own self. So they're like willing to say, you know, like old people just say whatever the hell they want. Oh yeah. So I project because old women say like, "Oh, I'm into you." That young women are also into me they're just more they're just not as confident to say yes. it yeah. like, I just imagine everybody is into you but they just don't know wants when wants a little piece of this crippled <laughs> that's what I think that's we should I'm... probably mention that you are actually crippled you're... and you're just not being I didn't know that your ass was crippled Dude, I'm all around. His asshole's right. not crippled. It's a small distinction. Dude, Just no, because well... he took his wife's butthole and put it in him. That's why. <laughs> yeah, we've Just done. always... Yep. All yeah. that bacteria finger you to finger, finger that finger. cross-pollination. Dude, I've got stories about poo, man. I could go on for days. Right, we'll, so we'll, I've we'll heard of fe- on I have that. heard of fecal transfer, transfers, yeah, though. Yeah, transplants, actually. Transfers. She's yeah. our medical student. Yeah. That's what I just I'm the resident medical student. Almost medical student. Wait, wait, wait. Is that not what I just talked about, the fecal transplant? The finger in the I don't think it's a finger in the butthole. Yours was a bacterial transplant. Wait, we... So no, I knew, like, what, you like should I, probably check that yeah, doctor's you, like wait, <laughs> medical. You may license. have just gotten molested. Yeah, you may have just gotten molested <laughs> by, by someone. Your, wait, 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 by was... your wife. <laughs> no, no, really. Trust me. Trust me. I yeah. need to put my finger in your ass. <laughs> this, no, this is a, my this is a medical asked, procedure. My aunt, all my aunts asked me. They said it'd be hilarious. Yeah. If I did. <laughs> I'm gonna kiss you on the mouth they're just while bi- I put the finger. In they're just living by curiously <laughs> through her. Like, oh, try this next time. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, all these. Yeah, that's that's not my wife. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So back to she's the... not adventurous. I'm the one who's always like, let's try uh-huh. something different. <laughs> not the butthole thing again, right? It doesn't work. It always no, comes back me. to the butthole. It's like a really erogenous sound. <laughs> it's so tender. <laughs> Uh, Dude, anytime I get my butthole touched, I feel so violated, though. I love it. <laughs> what, you love that you feel you, violated? Yeah, what? yeah. We'll... it's like an experience. Like you like the feeling of being violated, or you like the idea that you get violated by that? No, it's just... Because then you're like, good, I'm a normal person, and I'm not just like into this. Uh, no, it's the end of it. Okay. I think he's just into it's it. The other That's side. That's fine, too. I like both of them. That's kind of <laughs> like how I feel when I go to the gym. My OB, oh. you know? ob Like the first time, you're like 16, like... Oh, this is horrifying. Yeah. It really is. Ta- tell us about it. So. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah. Robot well, you have this exclusive. like 40-year-old man investigating yeah. your vagina. Oh, and it's like gosh, talking sounds... to you about your day. He's like, hey, uh, so you're in school. Like, kisses you on the mouth. <laughs> kisses you on the mouth. This Full is on the mouth. <laughs> That's standard yeah. standard part of the Like wait, yeah. my butthole has nothing to do with my this is... No, this is part of the this is part Cross of the pollination, trust me. Why, is, why are your pants why off? Are your pants? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so 16, spread an eagle. Yeah, and then they the worst part is they have the spotlight. So like you have the sheet over <laughs> so, a... and you scoot down, like scoot down further and you're like, "Okay," uh, until you're oh, right at the edge God. of the table and then uh, they take the light and they're like, "Okay." Like a dental like the one's like dental Like a dental lamps. lamp, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> like a vagina With a dental giant magnifying Wait, glass. Could you yeah. imagine being a 16-year-old dude and having a 40-year-old woman just like, I need you to just lay your junk out. <laughs> first kiss me on the for, mouth. Give me a yeah, right. Me. First kiss me on the mouth. That's how we start all these things. Yeah. Uh, first undress to your right. And I'm naked. naked. Yeah. I'm completely naked. Can and you... they have to inspect my breasts, too. So they say, wait, wait, what? what? Yeah, no, yeah, it's a you get a breast exam when you get your well woman exam. No, it's the same one. Oh, you have to put your arms up. (sighs) I don't know. Maybe I should check. I'm like, uh, (laughs) usually they specialize in one thing. Make you put your arms up like you're on like a roller coaster. And then you, (laughs) then you like roll like your lymph nodes like around the breasts, and then that's part of the exam too. Wow, I think anyways. There's like the old (laughs) me that's like, dude, it's just a body. Who cares? Like it doesn't matter. 
And then there's this 16 year old me that was like so insecure about oh, yeah, everything. Yeah. Yeah. And I could not imagine a 40 year old woman just like, I'm going to handle your package for a while. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Just the idea of like yeah. turning cough. And they always say, no, no, cough a little louder. You're just like, <laughs> like a, uh, but, <laughs> do you know but why they tell you so to turn fast? In, turn my head and cough? They only say that so that you don't cough on them. It literally has no medical reason oh. why you have to turn your head. Mm. Just, it's just so they it, you don't cough on them. Is it weird that I'm I'm pretty <laughs> sure that I've never gotten the physical <laughs> where I had to do that? Yeah, you were in a very athletic where you. Yeah, you no. didn't do anything. I didn't. Aww. Yeah. Don't my, first, Brian. my first, my first. No, that was a on fact. Him. Yeah, and you didn't get a physical. Yeah. You didn't play sports. Yeah, right? yeah. That's the only reason you got that. And why is it that a physical is just a dude handling your balls? Yeah, yeah. That's, right. That's something like, I never understood. And pissing in a cup. Yes. That's just like a drug. Those test? are the. Yeah, yeah. We're like, we're gonna give you physical. Like, what about the rest of me? Like, they're all checking the... for inguinal hernias, I think. Sub- Why don't well, they check to see, like, hey, you can't, you can't touch your toes. You probably <laughs> well, shouldn't play yeah, football. Like a handful of kids die every year because of like heart foot, conditions, yeah, other stuff. You just like, said football. Well, well, no, it was <laughs> because football. of foot, <laughs> because of foot. Just half a dozen kids die every year because of feet. Problems. Although, if you had a hernia, I doubt like. The, that exam is going to be when you find out that you're, there's something wrong. Oh, like yeah. you probably oh, yeah. realize you should know. Yeah. instantly that you're you like, had there's something. There's this thing that pokes out of my stomach every I got, time I, I sit I got one up. at the school and it they told me to like lay down and they were like reaching under my kneecaps and they're like, all right, uh, flex, flex your knees. <laughs> and I did it. And I could have sworn like he dug his hand underneath my kneecap and I went, oh. And he went, oh. And I was like, what? <laughs> And he's like, that shouldn't hurt. And I was like, you stuck your fucking hand under my oh. kneecap. No one does oh. that. Then he gave you a kiss, right? Oh, yeah, he gave me a kiss. For, right. That was the no, first thing he did. Start, yeah. Yeah. That's how you start every medical oh, obviously. <laughs> appointment. Thank you, so Mr. Bishop. Mm. Wait, what was that? So that was a physical? That was a physical at the school, and that was like for like kid orientation day, freshman year. I wanted to do swimming. Never did it. Kid uh, orientation day? Yeah. <laughs> Repeat that? Yeah, yeah. Like, you, like the first, the, where you go and you sign up and you get your, all your classes. And you're like, all right, here's your school badge. Here's your parking. Oh, okay. You know, all, all that right. stuff. Yeah. They had, that year they had like, yeah, you can get a physical here with the nurse for free and stuff. And I was like, yeah. Then <laughs> she kissed you on the mouth. Okay, that was the first thing she first did. First thing. Yeah. Yeah. Mouth. Yep. One of the first physicals I ever got at the doctor's office, and this is just kind of a, an embarrassing story, but... Went in, kissed her on the mouth, and then, <laughs> and then she, you know, she did the typical stuff, and then she asked me, "All right, here you go." And she pulled out this little empty vi- vial or whatever, like plastic. It looked like a one of those med cups. And then yeah, she's like, cup. "She goes, you know what to do with this?" And I go, "Yeah, I think so." And then she goes, "Okay, good. Take it in the restroom. I think so. Write your name on it, and then put it in the cupboard there." I was like, "All right." So I went in the restroom, took a piss, ripped my name okay. on the cup, and I put it in the thing. She walks. I go back, give her another kiss, and yeah. then she's like, "I was like, afraid you were gonna say you like jacked off." No, no, <laughs> that's, I thought that's I was where we were going. Afraid. I no, so, the, so then my mom's like in the room. What she? What you go ahead. My mom's in the room, and she's kind of laughing because you know she probably thought it was hilarious. And then she goes, "So All did you do it?" And I had to go, "Do I?" She goes, "Did you? Did you take a piss?" And I went, "Yeah." <laughs> and she's like, and "She's like, did you miss?" And I was like, "No." What do you mean? She's like, "Did you miss the cup?" And I, and I said, "I was like, <laughs> I was supposed to piss in the cup." <laughs> I literally went in, pissed in the <laughs> toilet, wrote my name on the cup, and then put it in. I was like, that was weird. Dude. Like, <laughs> that's a weird man. Seems like a weird, weird test. yeah. Why yeah. didn't I just... <laughs> <laughs> they could have written my own name on this cup and left it in here. So then I had to like go back and force myself to pee. <laughs> Dude, that's, worked, the, yeah. that's the it worst. Worked. When you have to like force out a pee. Oh, man. I'm, I love that. I think I'm developing a shy it. bladder, to you, be honest. I love it. A shy? <laughs> yeah. Have you ever heard of shy bladder? No, no. I've got the thing. I have... I call it performance anxiety. It's probably the same thing. Oh, it's like, not sex, though. If, well, I, yeah. <laughs> I can have sex when other people are looking, is what I'm trying As to long say. as they're oh, not peeing. Yeah. Them. Give them each a kiss have on the mouth. Have you seen those, like, right. female stand up pee devices? Those are awesome. It kind of yeah. looks like those a duck so bill. Neat. Yeah. yeah it looks like, like a, a funnel, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's a funnel. Those are so neat. I wish there was more stuff like that for I know. Men. I'd. For men, yeah, like you need it. Like I wish there was. I just ex- said yeah to that because yeah. I thought you said women. I was like, yeah, I want to be need... able to poop like a woman. <laughs> yeah, you want. I thought you maybe just wanted a longer penis. How do you think That'd you poop, nice JC? Yeah. yeah, I mean, you guys have some. You just holes. got the. You just got the one hole, right? That's how that. Yeah, okay. cloaca, just like the birds. <laughs> what? Okay, and what are you saying, right? I don't know. Oh, okay. 
birds. Yeah, that was like us. that was one of my first that's, that's doctor's experiences on. that I just fucked up. <laughs> like, had no idea that was the process in which you go to <laughs> get a physical. You haven't been back to the doctor funny. since, right? Probably, <laughs> honestly, that's the crazy. I don't go to the doctor very often. Brian, do you have a funny doctor story? Huh? Not really. Like, I got I broke. My knee, and that was that wasn't funny. <laughs> Did was you, Grandpa? Sad. I broke my knee. I broke my <laughs> knee. I, I was walking. <laughs> I was and walking. I, I just broke. snapped. I stood up. I was, I was playing. Stand up I was playing football, and I broke my knee. <laughs> that was, was a sad. fascinating story. I was playing Tecmo Bowl. Yeah, Grandpa. On the NES, and uh. <laughs> okay, Grandpa. And I was Bo Jackson because you can't catch that guy. He's in on, the yeah, game. he's the yeah. fastest yeah. one. Yeah. And Impossible. I just broke my knee. You, you, you broke your knee. It just broke right off. You broke Bo Jackson's knee. My own. You oh. you broke it playing tech. I was playing tech mobile. Okay. And then I went to stand up, and my right leg, my knee just broke right it, off. You're, it, it broke the whole leg, broke. <laughs> off. Yeah. Uh, so like I'm like it's like quadru quadricep, and then broken up, then just jagged mess. Okay. Yep. Um, Thank you. But Grandpa. listen, okay. Your story makes well, first of all, giving so much better. Mo. First, Grandpa, I'm really sorry because I didn't kiss you before that story. So come here. Okay. <laughs> Love you, Grandpa. Mm. Good. Okay. Good story. <laughs> grandma. Mm. <laughs> Your grandma's crazy. <laughs> she likes me with the one leg. But yeah, she, oh, she's kissing Ryan. This is really weird. She's, uh, she kept. She grandma. actually kept my broken off part of the leg and the foot, and that's just dead. And she just oh. keeps it around the house, and she uses it. Is that so, what she's been sweeping a, with? Right, and oh, as a back geez. scratcher sometimes. Oh, okay, it's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> grandma, can you stop sweeping while we're having this conversation? <laughs> Gr- grandma, Grandma, can you bring me just like a ginger ale? Is she, is she oh, okay. Is she did open on its own. That's weird. She's your grandma. I just call her grandma. Yeah, you don't call your mom, mom. Like, yeah. We call each other first grandpa I, and grandma. First, I called her. Sorry, first, I called her Ellie May, and then we got married. I called her Hun. Then we had kids, and I called her mom. And then our kids had kids, and I called her grandma. And that's just how it goes. So we don't confuse the grandkids. Okay, grandpa, that makes Ellie. sense. If they have kids, you gonna call yourself like Peepaw or something weird? Peepaw? No, just Grandpa. We don't do all that shit. We let uh, we let my uh, my wife's stupid husband have all the wacky wacky things. His his parents, that are Mima and Poppy. And- <laughs> what you said? You let your wife's husband have all. The- <laughs> no, are we my ending daughter. the scene anytime soon? <laughs> my daughter. <laughs> I think we broke okay. the scenes around his course. My daughter. Your daughter's <laughs> yes. husband. Okay. My daughter's okay. husband is a real piece of shit. Oh. Yeah, I, I told him no. That escalated quickly. He was like, hey, can I marry daughter? And I was like, you're a piece of shit. Oh, gosh. <laughs> and I only got one leg. I broke it off in Tech Mobile. You, you gave him a kiss before he asked you, right? be so rude. So he kissed like a, he he kissed like a real piece that. of shit, and that's why I knew. I oh, right sorry. off the bat. Got gotcha. you. Okay. Well, good story, Grandpa. Backspace. <laughs> yeah, but for uh, yeah, performance while peeing. Yeah, it's just like something that. <laughs> oh yeah. It's something that's just kind of. I don't know if I psyched myself out one time, but if I, I, I mean, if there's a bathroom and there's people in stalls near me, I can piss pretty fine as long as there's little dividers. But if I know there's someone behind waiting, yeah, I'm like, oh, bro, you gonna? Nope, I, I'll I'll leave the restroom, yep. wait till they get, yes. and I'm like, go back in, and be like, God, I can't do it. Sometimes though, I'll just be like, I'm gonna wait this out. Like if there's four <laughs> urinals and and there's a lineup of people, I'm like, I'm just gonna stand here yeah. and try and pee until everyone is done. Or I'll wait, or, or I'll wait for like the you know the poo urinals and go pee in there. The poo the urinals. Poo urinals. <laughs> You mean just the toilet, the regular no. toilets? Okay. This isn't a women's restaurant. The regular yeah. stalls, right? The stalls. I, I, the women. I just think it's hilarious because I never use the poo urinals. I'm not. Really? I'm not a weirdo. What are you pooing? The toilet. Oh, like a woman. There is no poo ur- urinals. <laughs> what are you talking about? Can he, I speak? There aren't. There Speaking aren't. of, so like, we all know the male etiquette in restrooms, right? Even I think even females sure. are like, yeah, you guys are idiots. I get it. Yeah. I have no <laughs> etiquette. I know you don't. All women yeah. Well, no, it, it yeah. depends is there on any, the. What I was going to ask for Kayla is there any like female rules of the restroom that we should know about? Obviously, like wait in a long ass line. Um, 
go into your own personal stall. Do you chit chat? Like when you go to like we do chit chat. No, yeah, I've had pretty Even intense conversations. Yeah, wow. with strangers when? in bathrooms. Like when That's does the, the chit chat end or start? That's the last thing. Yes. I want we'll, to do we all know well, it starts with a kiss. Oh my gosh, it starts with a kiss. Uh, kissed. Yep. Um, we're in line. Su- oh, a sun kissed. A Get sun kissed. Mm. Full kiss on the so mouth. So let's just okay. Let's pretend we're we're in line with Kayla going to the restroom. Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, okay. So. Oh my god. This line is so long. I, can't mm. guys, it. I just got a shit so bad. Yeah. Um, I'm. I'm Becky in the, is shot. I'm in mouth. the back of the line, so let me just kiss. Mm. Mm. New to the line. I love uh, going to the bathroom with you guys because I just like you and you kiss and like just so free and yeah. So oh, exciting. Oh, oh. Oh, Becky. Mm, sorry. Please. Sorry. I just Told gotta poo- you. I just gotta poo so bad. Uh, Shouldn't so I bad. eat that chili? Was, where do you have chili? Chilies. Wendy's. Oh, you like that place? <laughs> you like that Dude, place? Dude, the chilies of Wendy's isn't bad. <laughs> I don't mind it, though, if you pour it over chips. Chips? You or pour it you, over chips? They well, chips? sometimes I get chips separate. You can get chips separate there and just dip it in your chili. <laughs> don't, you don't ever do that? They sell chips? I didn't even know they sell chips. Yeah, yeah they have chips. chips. You can get chips in, uh, I think they have salsa, maybe, but... The chi- the, chi- <laughs> the children at Chili's. Are you doing okay? She Are really needs right? to go. She's freaking out right now. Oh, my gosh. The chili at Chili's is gluten-free, just so everybody oh, knows. Oh, really? I didn't yeah. know that. I'm allergic to gluten-free things. It you know? does. I don't, like to, Becky. Oh, I don't like to oh, eat oh, Becky. <laughs> Becky, please. You're so disgusting. Putting your hand over your butt doesn't keep the poop in, by the way. You're still, it's still going to come around. If I put your hand on your anybody, face, does, Becky. Does anybody need a fecal transplant? No. I've been thinking about that. Is that a, that's a thing, right? I read about it in Cosmo. Yeah, yeah. If It's all the rage. Let's ask our med student. <laughs> did you know if you did the alphabet on... And it's only true. Is it? Mm. Oh. oh. It's going to be mean. okay. We love you. Don't worry. And sing. <laughs> Wow, very interesting conversations you guys have. I not stop. I'm so interested, uh, though, in that. Okay. In the real conversations the, or I, what that shit was? No, right in there. the real. So, like, here's how I picture it, though. Like, you get in line with six women, and then you're talking, and one by one you go into a stall. So, like, you're, like. Sometimes we keep talking when we're Yes, going that's what I want to know. Yeah, yeah. 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 No, no, that's yeah. exactly what I know. And someone uh-huh. will be like, oh, fuck. Ah, I love it. <laughs> Can we say F word? We literally just made shit noise. Oh right. Can, like oh fuck, I don't have any toilet paper. And like, can someone just like reach it? And like, okay. yeah, girl, fuck yeah, I got it. And then they just reach over. Okay, and, like, I feel like okay. Five girls no, have a stack. How of- guys is- would not do that? Like we would just walk out dirty ass. Ew. What? No. <laughs> have you ever been in a men's restroom where there's no toilet paper? Okay, I was just about to tell. Yeah, a place called Mimi's Cafe. Oh, we yeah. went in there oh. for breakfast. Okay. And someone had just like an employee had just <laughs> left cleaning the place. A place called. <laughs> I didn't want to. I don't want to use the real name, but we'll call it Mimi's Cafe. Okay. So it's Hypoth- owned by it's owned by somebody named Mimi. Hypothetical. Hypothetically, we'll hypothetical call it Mimi's Cafe. I went in there. Uh, an employee before I walked in walked out of it, and I went took a D, and I was sitting there <laughs> thinking like, all right, took this is going right good. Now. Okay, that it was, sounds like it was like one of those like JC bent over and had a yeah, man. Yep, took a D right in the A. Well, I kissed him first. And right. So then, yep. And then you took a D and took All right, a D. So, you took your so and then so while I'm t- that loosened it up. <laughs> you know, what I realized I, I meant to. I'm like in my head, I was saying like took a like a, like a dump, deuce. a dump or a oh. deuce. I was thinking deuce. Yeah. And then it. I don't a know why I didn't say a P or an S, but poo 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 P. And then he uh, could be penis too, though. Yeah, so. dang, there's no winning. Dang, penis. penis. I just You're took really it. But it was so... one of those ones where, like, your stomach's grumbly. Like, you wake up, you're like, "Oh man, I need to go." And I do it, and I'm like, "Okay, this is a, like one of those instant, you know, it's a wipe situation." Yeah. <laughs> it wasn't a clean. No toilet clean paper in that shit. stall. I don't think I've ever had one. That I wasn't got a wipe out of that situation. stall, <laughs> just... went into the other stall. No toilet paper in there. I went to get up in the sink to see if they had paper towels. There was no paper towels, and oh, I was like, "What the no. fuck." Luckily, in one of the stalls, the one I was originally in, there was toilet liner, and I wiped my butt. And I was you pretty pissed off. You are insane, it's resourceful. dude. Okay, That's but, resourceful. I would, yeah. yeah, I mean, I was, what are you gonna do? I was Just, pretty pissed off. So yeah. then I go... And I leave, and I'm like, hey, I need to talk to a manager. And they're like, is everything okay? It's like, I just want to talk to your manager. And I tell him, like, dude, I was just in there, and there's no toilet paper. Like, I I had to, like, figure a way to clean myself up. <laughs> like, there's nothing in there I could wipe my ass with. And he goes, Bruh. all right, cool, thanks. 
dude, I'm sorry. Yeah. We're just fresh out, man. No, but bro, <laughs> you understand? Like, I, I came here to eat breakfast, and instead I – Dude, how are the uh, home fries? They're fine, but – Did you get a uh, Bloody Murray? No, I, I got the I got the mimosa, but your mimo. Ah, oh, did you get the uh, the grenadine in there? No, I I didn't. I, Just straight uh straight up orange, yeah, orange juice, juice and uh, yeah. But I, I took a shit. Chand- and there was uh, no was it chandelier. No champagne. Champagne. A chandelier. Dude, did you something. like our chandelier? We just put that in, in the front. That has nothing to do with what I. Yeah, do. Veronica. She's our hostess. Isn't she hot? I kind of feel bad about that because I'm married and, you know, she's only 16. But, dude, right? It's kind of weird when a guy talks about How is your muffin? It's fine. So I took a I shit in there. Did you get blueberry or bran? <laughs> there was no toilet paper in there. Blueberry or bran muffin? I, I skipped on the muffin. But there's no toilet paper in the restroom. And I just took, like, a huge shit. So, Dude, you shit in public restrooms? What's wrong with you? N- were you some kind of animal? No, I just I had to go. Oh, because but you didn't get the brand muffin. No, there was there was no toilet paper in the restroom. Oh, hey, hey boss, bummer. I just checked the bathroom. Yeah, so good. What do you dude, mean, good? Kev, you're, dude, Kevin's the rock star yeah. here. He's the man. What do you mean? Did you put toilet paper in there? Well, did you did you have a muffin? No, I didn't have the muffin. Why didn't you have the muffin? Okay. You wouldn't have pooped. What did you order for breakfast? Tell me what you got a mimosa. Just just a mimosa? What were you wearing? Shorts. Veronica here wants to know. She's interested. Uh, She's like our hostess. She's 16. I'm not going to tell her what I was. She's so hot. She's so hot. She's so hot. I'm so hot. First of all, Veronica, nice to meet you. Hi. Um, Second of all, I was wearing shorts. But there's, guys, there's. Zero toilet paper in there. But I'm kind of pissed. How many drinks did you have before you went? Are in you the all, dude? This is it's eight thirty in the morning. How drunk are you? I I had one mimosa, and that you're lightweight. No, oh, I'm not drunk. Man. I just Veronica, like, this were you giving the toilet a wrong like the wrong idea? Like, were you leading the toilet on? Like, oh, I don't know. I just I took. Were you flirting with the toilet? No. What? Dude, Veronica's got this whole thing. She's crazy. She doesn't even understand. She's so only she's crazy. a kid. You know how kids these days. Kids are not crazy. Why, did, why didn't you use the poo urinal? I I did. You, you just said you used the toilet. Of course there's not any toilet paper in there. What why wouldn't there be toilet paper in there? Well, cuz we got the poo urinals. Oh. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. So like we're talking you took a big poo. So like did like eighty percent of the poo get stuck to you, and twenty percent end up in the toilet, or is it like an 80, 80 20 the other I, way? I'd probably say sixty forty. Did you order an omelet? Did you get the Denver omelet? I did. Yeah. Oh, uh, it's my favorite. It's Maybe my you favorite. went into good. like the. You know what? I'm good. Thanks, guys. I'm just right. gonna go. That's, <laughs> that's about what happened, though. Like I was so pissed <laughs> off, and then I told the manager, he was like, "All right, thanks," and I was just like. No, I want like a fucking refund on my <laughs> meal. I had a terrible time a here. Refund on. That's I want a refund on my shit. I want you to take my shit, put it back into my asshole. But you know what I mean? Like, I'm pissed off that I pooped here. I went there to go have like a nice breakfast, and I spent and half poop. the time like freaking Fighting the fuck out because yeah. I couldn't wipe my ass. There's nothing worse than like <laughs> having the rug ripped out from underneath you when you go to like a, a eating facility mm-hmm. like a <laughs> establishment is what the word i meant to say or a restaurant and, or a restaurant <laughs> um some more you know an eating it's... establishment when you like you see something that's <laughs> most definitely a health code violation and you're instantly uh. just like after you ate too and you're like oh you know brunch on a no. sunday yeah you like friggin' your hammer from the night before <laughs> right? So you're super Some hungover. Some people, I guess. And it's like noon, and then you show up and you're wanting the Denver omelet. <laughs> <laughs> and you're just like, you got that, you got that, I was drunk last night and I need to take a poo thing. Okay, I gotcha. No, I gotcha. And then you want a refund on your meal because your poo wasn't <laughs> satisfied. I'm just saying, no, like, it, just, it like, was like, it was such a bad have... experience. You know, like, what, what are I mean? the employees? That's what I wonder. Like when the, when you see that stuff, or there's no soap in the bathroom. And I'm you surprised wonder, like, they didn't ask me. So wait, how? Like, have you wiped you wipe? yet? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like they didn't give a shit. They're like, okay, thanks. All right, and thanks, I was bud. sitting there like, wait, what? Don't you understand about like I couldn't wipe my ass. And then okay. you have to think about what the employees <laughs> are doing, like what what that previous <laughs> so employee good. did. Yeah, like that means no one that means washed their hands before working today. 
Wait, Wait why didn't are, they wash their hands? There was no to- there was no u- paper towels they in there. Usually oh, they usually have... wash their hands in the kitchen. Yeah, they got a kitchen sink. Yeah, we'll see. Do they? They don't wash their hands in point. the kitchen. That's where they don't wash their hands. <laughs> no yeah. said. No That's said. A... Do they? That's the greatest argument, dude. But... Bro, Do they? I feel. What if he was just like, uh-huh. hey, we just uh-huh. ran out. Like, it, dude, I know. Uh... They do. We that sent. Sucks. Hey, we sent Viv. She's on. She's at she's Albertsons on, on right run. now. Yeah. She's on the TP run. <laughs> they stopped. I'll they stopped. be back in five hours. <laughs> <laughs> and that is minimum wage. That's the yeah. Minimum, yeah, yeah. That's like, for, that's hot for. Hot. What do you do over there, Mimi's? Oh, I'm going toilet paper. Sixteen-year-old <laughs> hot Veronica, five hours at Albertsons. Like I couldn't find. Have you ever? I don't What's... know where it is. What I what's in Albert's? Sense? I went up and down every aisle. Found some double stuffed Oreos. I couldn't find them. <laughs> I didn't want to ask anyone because I was so embarrassed. And then I saw a guy <laughs> in like an astronaut's uniform. That actually happened to me. I was at Fry's. What? No, I know. Weird segue. I'm sorry, but it just popped into my head. But I was on the phone, and this guy walked by me. Well, that's he was weird. In an astronaut's uniform, and he looked fit. So like, I didn't. It didn't look like a costume, uh-huh. and it fit, had like, like British NASA. fit or like. Fit like workout fit. Uh, the second one. Okay. All right. Yeah. And I really wanted to ask him if he was a real astronaut, but I didn't. You're was this 16, where was this I here hope. in yeah. Arizona? God, in Arizona. When? He was not an astronaut. <laughs> Please be a child. How old were you what when if... this happened? <laughs> First of all, you gave him a kiss and you signed. Oh, how, yeah. how often do you say, please be a child, by the way? Yeah. <laughs> Just, only when I hear stories that are like, God, I hope an adult doesn't think this shit. <laughs> okay, first of all, guys, um, I didn't ask him, so there's no way for sure to know if he was a real astronaut. True. So, and this happened. I just don't think astronauts are just walking in <laughs> astronaut gear. Did he, to the store. did he have like a full on helmet on and stuff? You know. Recently, I was at an. No, Arizona... he was in the. Orange suit, like the Sun. undersuit, not like a. Was this a prisoner? Yeah, it sounds like, like a. Yeah, it, that was there like a number on his? Stop like, making yeah. fun of my a, astronaut he story. Pilot <laughs> number right there. It Maricopa said NASA. County, <laughs> County this is legit. The traditional uh, NASA tattoo on his eye. <laughs> yeah. Teardrops. He could have been an astronaut. Tears from heaven. This yeah. happened a couple years ago. It was so. And like for some reason. Twenty four. The lady who checked me out was dressed as a witch. I thought she might have been a real witch. A real witch. witch this was Halloween, by the way. <laughs> October thirty first. No significance to the story. I'm glad you had to, to tell story. us it was Halloween. The you dude were like, behind <laughs> the 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 deli counter had this whole like. He looked like Frankenstein. Is that <laughs> so a real weird? Thing? It's so and weird. all of these Oreos are orange stuff. They're usually just white cream inside. <laughs> Bats like white, everywhere. White cream. <laughs> That's what you call it. The white cream, right? <laughs> Who calls it white cream? What do you call the stuffing in an Oreo? <laughs> white, white. You yeah, the white up. cream. Yeah. You're like, oh, hey. Can I get the cookies with the white cream? I'm looking for them. <laughs> yeah. I'm looking for them cookies with a double white cream in them. Yeah, I mean, mm, when it's orange, double though, white. what do you say? <laughs> the orange cream? Or do you just say the orange? You know what I wish Oreos did? I, don't know. I wish Oreos were double cream, cookie. Double cream cookie, double cream. <laughs> it's just that's not the even entire like, a, like the, <laughs> the entire sleeve is just you one. You can't cookie. even you can't even like hold up <laughs> cookie because one part's cream. Yeah, yeah, you're it's, like, no, oh, two man. parts are cream. Oh, so it's no, cream on the it's, outside. It's cream, cream on, on the outside. outside. Cream on the inside. I, that's how much I love cling the cream. On the inside. Yeah. You can just throw. So you those don't think he was a real astronaut away. then? <laughs> well, no. you, I mean, I was the lady who checked you out a real witch? I mean, that's all I don't even know. Well, Where was the good was, question? Was this, is that like good a question. like a fries or something? Yeah, it was just that fries. The Dude, grocery store. if you would have said Smiths, I would have believed you. But fries, no way. <laughs> Astronauts don't shop at fries. Maybe bashes. <laughs> maybe bashes. Maybe Whole Foods for sure. Whole Foods bashes. actually. I just my question is, where do you think an astronaut would be out here? Like, why would there be a full on astronaut in Phoenix? I still also want to know how old you are. You said, she said uh, it's like 24. Ago. It was a couple years ago. Okay. <laughs> it was 24. So, so she was a child. Yeah, so younger. Definitely younger, though. So Yeah, totally. A couple years. Super younger. Yeah. Man. <laughs> I love that story. I should have asked. <laughs> yeah, you should have. You really should have. <laughs> like, that would have cleared it up. That, and then he would have been like, what are, it's, no, it's Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Dang it. Like, again? How old are you? You got me oh, again. I can just imagine you walking yeah. around the store. Are you, are you really Peyton Manning? <laughs> What? No, I'm wearing a jersey. Oh my god, Peyton Manning. It's, it's Sunday. It's, yeah, it's, football. it's the game song. It's football just supporting Sunday. my team. You were so there good in go. the Super Bowl. I loved you in the and Super Bowl. He was Bowl. the MVP of that Super Bowl for sure. 
Can I have your autograph? Oh my god, are you really a Girl Scout? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Thank god. Oh my are you, god. Are you really a ladybug? <laughs> you're just talking <laughs> to a ladybug. <laughs> 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 Asking ladybugs if they're actually ladybugs. Is that what you are? Is that what you are, ladybug? What... Do you guys ever... I think about buying ladybugs sometimes. You walk Buying into... them? Well, what? What? Can you buy ladybugs? <laughs> In Whole Foods. What? What? Are to you... eat? No. <laughs> For your garden. Why really? are they called Whole Foods? Yeah. They have these at Whole Foods? Well, it's like, you know where the carts are? Have you guys... I'm going to look this up. Does anyone <laughs> shop at Whole Foods? She's our, I, she's I, our med student. I do, so. and I always yeah. feel bad when I do because it's like three times more expensive. You're wrong about that. It is, if you buy processed food. <laughs> it is. You're right, if you buy processed food. <laughs> Ladybugs. But like, no, 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 you can get like in the front section, they got the carts and they got the... Firewood. And they, yeah, they got ladybugs in there too. I didn't know that. Yeah. That's interesting. Not I, all the when time. I was growing up They're in Indiana... Seasonal. They had we had like an infestation of ladybugs one year. Was that I good? had a house. It was supposed in... to be lucky, but it was also just like gross because there were bugs <laughs> that oh, were living in our okay. house. Okay, in your house. In, well, yeah. like, it, it, they, no, they would like it was like a corner, and it, like they got in and they started like nesting yeah. in like an mm. area. What? Yeah, we had that. That's true. I had a house in Durham, North Carolina, the best that had a ladybug infestation, and me and my wife were like, on board with it. We did not care. Yeah, like is in that the worst? Our, Why would you? Yeah, in our bedroom. 300, like, more ladybugs oh, than you can man. count. We're what? Just like, yeah, that's, that's... No, that's... Okay, now yeah. we're like, bordering a line this, of, like, the horror it, movie. Isn't it beautiful? beautiful? Oh, my gosh. Look at those ladybugs. You know, they're we so could probably charge them. people to come see So you realize they're shitting all over the place. I bet we could open a, an exhibit. <laughs> yeah, like the <laughs> butterfly guns. don't poo. These are... They're yeah. eating all a the... A lady eggs. doesn't poo. <laughs> they are... N- <laughs> or Girls fart. actually don't. And they don't talk poo. about it if they do. A group of ladybugs is called a flutter, isn't it? Yeah, flutter a ladybugs. Flutter ladybugs. I feel, I feel like that's the start of like a horror movie. Like a flutter. family moves into a house <laughs> and they're just like, oh my God, these ladybugs are so beautiful. And then like, we don't care. And then they get like possessed by some sort of demon And then bug Jason's ghost. there for some reason. <laughs> no, yeah. that's, that's not how it happened at all. Speaking of scary movies, we should all go see The Conjuring too. Yeah. I haven't seen The Conjuring one. I love scary oh We God. should watch Do you like the Conjuring movies one. in general? I like movies. I like horror. I love scary movies. Okay, so this yeah, movie, like the Conjuring. one, it's a scary movie. Like, it is legitimately scary. Two, it's a good it's a movie. Goal. All right, I think we should put it I on. I love The Conjuring, the first it's a one. Good Let's put movie. it on right now and watch it, and we'll talk about it. Okay, that's the other thing is I can't watch movies that I like yammering on. Drives <laughs> everybody I know crazy. Yeah. I did I have too. a good friend from high school, and his brother, he was like, he was telling his brother they started hanging out with me again. And the only Wait, what? Way... Hold on. <laughs> he was telling his... <laughs> okay. So, I so got at this... one point, he's like, I'm not hanging out with him. That right. Brian okay. Again. So it's me. Okay. I haven't hung out with my friend Dave in 20 years. Oh. Me and Dave start hanging out again. And Dave <laughs> tells his brother, Jordan, <laughs> that like, hey, we're hanging out. And he's like, who's that? He's like, oh, he's the guy who wouldn't shut up during movies. It's like, oh, yeah. I hated that kid. <laughs> <laughs> That's what everyone so he's like to trying hear. to convince his brother to hang out with you again. It's junior high, yeah. Oh wow, that's, that's cool. my whole life. Uh, you talk a lot during memories. movies. I'll, I can't. I can't help it. If it's, if I'm in a theater, I won't. But if I'm okay. at home, okay, that's then that's different. Yeah. Yeah. No, yeah, I'll watch. I'll watch movies in in HD. in the theater, and I'll be perfectly in quiet HD. unless it's funny. Because then I'll yeah, and I'll watch them in <laughs> HD. Crazy enough, but yeah, when it's at home, like it, dude. I. I'll sometimes pause the movie and just be like, can you fucking believe what we just watched? And people are like, no, start it again. Like, hold on. We Let's just think about, about this. this for a second. Did you realize what happened? I get into it. Have Dude, you, you seen The to... Troll Hunter? It's like a, a Swedish D-rated film, right? horror movie on Netflix. Is it Swedish? Oh my, have you seen the... Uh... Where he's where it's like a guy who actually goes, hunts trolls in the Nordic, and you see these like giant tall trolls. Is it trolls? like faux documentary style? I don't know. You were the one who told me about it, and I'm asking you now. So <laughs> have I haven't actually seen, seen it. Oh well, then why? Oh. <laughs> wait, wait, what about? Have you guys seen the Human Centipede? I apologize. I have I not haven't. actually. No, I've avoided that. I've one. just seen glimpses. I didn't watch the whole thing, but I like skipped ahead because I wanted just wanted to see the finished product of it, and like that was uh, that's all I needed to see. Like oh, they showed man. her the girl's face sewed, sewed onto into the, the butthole, butthole right? and then like her sutures were getting infected. Yeah, I've seen and it. So I watched the whole thing. And so he squishes in her mouth, and then it just green They've made ooze. three of it's, them. It's, it's 100% medically okay. accurate. I've, I've never... Okay, I watched... They made three of them? I watched yeah. the first one. They're making I, a newer yeah. one, I think, still. 
Yeah. I, I'm why? sure they make because they make money. <laughs> That's why. The Infin- do they? The Infinipede? I don't know what it's called. It can't cost How very much. How much money do they the, make? It cannot cost Finipede? very much. That's to a good make name them. for it. The Infinipede. And it's like, it's four people in there. He connects them all together. Yeah. <laughs> The Infinipede. I don't know how you feed that person, though. I like scary movies. Okay. That's just kind of like... You just feed them right before you start Yes. You feed all... You stuff everyone completely (laughs) full. It's like that scene in Seven. all up in the... It's the scene in Seven where the guy dies of being too fat. So here's my... So they sew the butthole, the mouth to the butthole. How do (laughs) they get any liquids? Like, do they sew like the... See, the idea is you have... You feed the first person... And then their excrement feeds the no, next I get, person. I get how that. Oh, what I'm saying oh. though is well, like, that, how do you're not, not the worried question. about the liquid part. The liquid part. Like, you, no people need to drink. drink too much That's, about you're it. thinking yeah. too much about it. It's We're not, talking about a human centipede. It's not that like complex. Right yeah, the concept. The dude. second, like and if you third like were person, to sew like both parts into the mouth, like I could see that happening. The second and third person like die of like yeah. I don't think your questions will ever be answered. Yeah, I'm not really into like. Gore movies, though. It, I mean, when I, I watch that, all I could think about is that girl getting the part. It's the only thing I could think about. Oh my about. god, I'm about to make it, mom. Yeah. Well, yeah, it's, yeah, that's <laughs> it. Like, mom, you said I wasn't going to amount to anything. Fuck you. I got a part. I'm playing the middle on a human centipede. <laughs> I'm not going to be ashamed of this in 10 years. Like, no, you're about as important as that one girl in the fifth Saw movie. Good job. Mm-hmm. She used to just get toilet paper at Mimi's Cafe and look at her now. Mm. She's part of the human think, centipede. I yeah, think my favorite Veronica, part about... Man, she, she made it. My favorite part about the Saw movies is they, they like continued to try to like make the story really like impressive. Oh, just, like, they really like... They really the first I've one, it was so good, and then they're like, one. oh, by the way, this is an eight-movie yeah. series. And you're like... Yeah, really? Boy. Eight movies. Yeah, and they're like this. Oh yeah, remember this in that movie? Like the by the sixth or seventh one, it was. I think I've seen all of them at this point, but they were like ninety percent flashbacks. It was wow. literally like remember really? remember when this happened and when this happened and when this happened and when this happened. Well, this person was actually there then, and you're just like, <laughs> oh, too much. Sure, and they're just okay. like. Phew. Yeah, Magic. and you're just like, ah, oh, my brain exploded. Oh my god! I haven't even seen the first Saw movie. That it's worth seeing. That's, that, that's a classic, no, I think, yeah, the in the first horror franchise. Good. Yeah, even the second. I one. I like the yeah. There's the part where like they stick their hands through the razor blades. That was the third one. Dude, now you re- now. Well, I'm not gonna watch it now. But okay. the entire time, I was just like, all you gotta do is put the other hand and hold the razor blades out. He of hasn't the way. seen it, so he doesn't. You, all you said is <laughs> no, he puts cause... his hands through razor blades, and now you're like, no, you just put one hand first and then the other, and you. It's like, well, we, he already said he wasn't gonna see it now, so okay, it's fine. Spoiler alerts for yeah. people who haven't seen Saw. Well, she didn't know that there were there. Were, <laughs> no, she did. They were like, "Look, this is not." I guess she could have tested it first, but I don't think she was that smart. It's a meme now, <laughs> like <laughs> that girl. Yeah, it's considered like one of the dumbest things you've ever seen in horror f- films. Yeah, no, it's pretty stupid. I mean, you got to be skeptical. You're in like a a crazy ha- house. House. <laughs> You're in a crazy house. That's some crazy. First thing you do when you go into Saw house is you kiss Saw. Go to that doll and just. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, jigsaw. So, uh, so where, so what are we gonna do? This is a. Yeah, this is. Um... Is this like a game? Right, it's like a survive game. Exactly. Oh, this is excellent. We're gonna play a game. It was like what? This oh, was like. Games. I got a Groupon. Mm-hmm. This is my. This is a Groupon. Thing? It's called Escape the Room. All right. It's a it's a big trend in you know always metropolitan just areas. Having some shrimp on the barbie and I ended up in here. Yeah. yeah. Um, first, before we go in, uh, can I get a kiss from? Right. Mm. I'm a wooden doll, so I give clocky kisses. <laughs> oh, I love that. That's so nice. Like, Thanks. I like clocky kisses. Come into who's, my house. Who's this Australian guy? He's so buff. Oh, I'm yeah. Chip from. Sydney, and I. It's really. His, it's not important at all. Look at to, his to abs. The story. They're like so. They're glistening. Still not important to the story. We should really get in the house. So, so, so can I? Can I just leave if I wanted to? Uh, yeah. I'm wondering oh. if Chip wants oh, was easy. maybe interested. Yeah, you in, like, can't this, leave. If you want to leave, you just go out this door right here. Wait, wait. Right, well, I'm I'm gonna go out this door right <laughs> here. Chip, wait, is Chip <laughs> running this <laughs> thing? My He's dead. My arm. Oh, a coke bottle. Sorry. <laughs> Did, wait. Oh, did, this is refreshing, but my arm is missing. What's wrong with Veronica's arm? <laughs> Veronica, you don't. What is going on? Oh, look at that. If I see shrimping me, If you try to leave, you'll I, die. I honestly can't take my eyes off Chip's abs. 
He's really not. Oh, you should do some push-ups. They're just real oh, quick. Oh my! Goodness. Good luck doing push-ups on these tacks <gasps> I put on the floor. <laughs> oh my gosh! This, <laughs> the more push-ups you do, the more tacks you get in your chest. <laughs> these hands are like bleeding. You'll, and like, you'll bleed to death. Oh my goodness! This yeah. is, oh. <laughs> and he Chip, is, I can take those tacks out like with my teeth. <laughs> one by one. Do you want me to do that for you? You're all that's, you're all that's left, oh. Becky. Ooh, you're all that's left. Wait, hang. Wait, what? Yep, the other two are dead. Dead? You only have one way to escape. With this group on, is I hang. This what's the one way? Is you, it kisses? Yes. <laughs> you did it. You found the secret. Oh my goodness. Goodbye. I'm going to recommend this to all my friends. You're getting you a four star review on Yelp. What the fuck? Why not five? But I thought the four was the top end. Okay, no, I'll no, you... five is the highest. It's out of five. Well, I lost two friends in here, so four is okay. Yeah, right? You should be lucky you made it out at all, bitch. <laughs> Listen, Chip was so handsome, and like Veronica was. She, yeah, Chip had nothing to do with anything. He <laughs> was just another was my person best that came to friend. Okay, yeah, that is unfortunate, but I'm I don't control that. Just, it's just forced. I'm still like, alive. <laughs> wait, hang on. Okay, it's five stars. She's still alive. Oh, okay, good. Okay, uh, well, yeah, tell your friends, and uh, I will see you next time. Oh, thank you. Right, bye. All right, guys. Well, we've come to the end of our episode here. Wait, it's the end. I still have more horrible things to say about <laughs> seeing movies. I okay. I mean, we'll we'll there will be more of these. Don't worry. Oh. <laughs> but, Do you want to uh, plug anything? I mean, your mouth for starters. Hey, um, hey I didn't get start. to talk about being a wingman. Oh man, dude, there's so you, much stuff. we got right. a sidetrack. Yeah, yeah, next time there's always. I only remembered because this picture came on my phone. Hey yo. So Ryan, you Hey-o. like to plug things. What do you, what would you like to plug? Um, I got a show. When's this coming out? I don't know. Probably in like two weeks. Um, let me see what two weeks is from. On June 26th, I'm performing at the Tempe Improv. Yeah. Oh, for nice. the Arizona Comedy Festival. For the Arizona Comedy Festival, which is That's a real insane. thing. And, uh, yeah, <laughs> Sunday. So, anyway, I'm doing that. I'm doing seven minutes of stand-up and ten T- minutes of Tempe improv. improv. Tempe Improv, all the way in awesome. downtown Tempe. Downtown Tempe. Downtown Tempe. Mm-hmm. Um, I sell houses every day. Mm. You you sell at least one house every day? <laughs> Dang, you're Gosh, doing great. Wow, you're doing really well. I did sell one today, but it would be nice if I did that every day. Oh, I mean, it's not keep a, trying. It's like right now it's like a once a week thing That's still lately. not bad either. That's, yeah, no, yeah. that's really good. But it would be, yeah, but that's only going to last. That was like the last three weeks. Yeah. It probably isn't going to happen next week. <laughs> and where can they find you? But maybe. Where can they find you for that? Um, You can find me on Instagram. Uh, or no, 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 Twitter. Okay. Sorry. I'm at rxpxjx. And what's your website for your business? Oh, ryanpauljohnson.com. It's a train wreck. Yes, okay, we'll work on it. It's a train wreck. Kala? Just a... All right. Nothing from you, I guess. Well... <laughs> No, I mean you got your blog. A blog involved. Oh yeah, there is. you were I telling know, me about that. A funny blog about things that happen to you. I don't know if it's funny, but um, not funny blog. We'll be the judge of that. We'll leave five it's stars if you thought it was funny. Kayla selectively comments dot com. Great, so, great name. That's it. Yeah. Great name. Is it like a WordPress blog? What is that? WordPress? Yeah, kind it's of. A Squarespace. Yeah, Squarespace. it is Squarespace. <laughs> cool. I'll check it out. Yeah. Uh, Brian. Uh, there's there's this podcast. It's called um, Robot Sidekick. Oh, where can they find it? Uh, they can find it on Facebook. dot oh, That's a good place. Slash you robot can't sidekick. Find it there. You cannot find the podcast there. Really? <laughs> you can find it on YouTube. Hey. You can oh, find well, it you, on we can find our information. Oh, you, can you can find can, our information on. <laughs> you can find it on iTunes. That's where you can find the podcast. You can find the podcast on SoundCloud. dot com slash robot sidekick. I love SoundCloud, man. Yeah. The think, only thing I have on SoundCloud is me yelling at a lady. <laughs> okay. I have a SoundCloud account. That's right. It's, a, it's you, you destroying a heckler. It's me, yeah, yelling at a heckler. Yep. Awesome. That's the only thing I have up there. Uh, yeah, you can like us on Facebook. We just went over 200 likes. Wow, you guys. Whoa. Wait for this podcast? Yeah. Oh my God. Isn't that exciting? Gosh, that is exciting. Well, just not the podcast, but the whole entire Robux psychic in general. I don't, I'm almost at 200 likes on my real estate website, <laughs> which makes me sad. You're getting there, big man. Yeah. yeah. But uh, if you yeah, subscribe, subscribe to us on iTunes, subscribe to us on YouTube, and follow some new videos that we're going to be having coming out. It's going to be super exciting. Uh, you can also check out some of us at Improv Mania, hopefully all of us one day, performing improv comedy every Friday nights and Saturday nights, 7 to 9 o'clock. Check it out at improvmania.net. But until next time, guys, it's been such a pleasure. Bye.
It has been a pleasure. You. It's been a great pleasure. All right, kisses. Yeah. Kisses. Bye. Bye. And we'll see you later. Bye. I love you. Love you so much. Love you so much. Love you so much.